Gold County Fire Protection District Code of Ethics. The Code of Ethics provides guidance to the members of the CFPB so they can discharge their responsibilities. The relationship to the community. Each member of the fire district is expected to demonstrate the highest standard of personal integrity, truthfulness, honesty, and stamina in all public activities. When speaking and active as a private person or member of a group, members of the district should not create the impression that they speak or act for the fire district. All members should avoid any activity giving rise to conflict of interest, actual or perceived. No members of the organization shall use the district name, logo, letterhead, or affiliation in any way to obtain profit, personal gain, or favors. No member shall use affiliation with the district to connect with a partisan political campaign or lobbying activity in any way. Conduct and participate in community events and consider every person a taxpayer. In relationship to the fire district, supporting the mission to the CCFPD, members abide by this ethic statement, organizational statement, SOGs, and policies of the fire district. They maintain the right to use appropriate means to seek revisions to the statements and policies. All members take responsible steps to protect against disclosure of confidential information. All statements of policy or personal positions shall be formally approved by the chief before any release. No member may use the department title or affiliations in connection with a commercial or organizational endeavor. Members shall use their affiliation only during their term of such affiliation. Members maintain high standards of professionalism and provide quality standards of performance. We seek to participate in appropriate professional development activities. Members seek to advance the welfare of the district through accountability for the use of district funds, personal equipment, and other resources. Relationships to each other. Each district member is responsible and accountable for his or her own actions, and to some extent for the well-being of the other members. Remember these behaviors and practice them on a daily basis. They are be considerate of everyone's values, ideals, possessions, feelings. Have discretion. Be discreet when communicating with other fire members. Be tolerant of our differences, whether they're anything from race, color, creed, faith, unity. During good times and in difficult times, the organization must continue to work together as a team. Remember, individuals make a team. Exploration, discrimination, abuse, harassment, and insensitivity are always wrong. It is the responsibility of our members to strive to eliminate them, whether they are unconscious, conscious, covert, or overt, while taking care to respect the rights of others. Respect towards positions of authority and leadership shall be granted as the people who have earned such positions have worked hard to obtain them, and such positions are critical to our semi-military form of decision-making. Practice safety, safety in all aspects of the fire district's activities and progressive disciplinary actions can include discharge, may be imposed for cause of a member in find, finding of the violations of the codes. And we'll talk about that in section 104-1 disciplinary actions.